Hello everybody, this is Money Mom. Welcome back to the channel. Money Making Monday, let's get started. I basically have one way to make money. I've got two companies to tell you about it. As you guys know, every Monday I like to give you a new fresh idea. This way you can see if it's something that works into what works in your lifestyle. What I like about this one is it's especially good for people that are homebound. What it basically is, is you're going to be a call monitor. And it's not really exactly mystery shopping, but you're going to listen to phone calls. And there's two companies, I'm going to list them below, A-R-L-L-C and Humantix. And basically the first one, A-R-L-L-C, you're listening to customer service type calls. You're not, you're actually just listening to the call. You're not calling yourself and answering questions. Then you have to listen and see what their customer service skills are like and what they can improve on. Now, Humantix, you're also kind of doing the same thing, but you're going to be doing something where you're categorizing calls and putting them in different categories. I have not done this yet, so I haven't, don't know much about it. And until I actually do something, it's a little challenging to explain what it is. So I think I'm going to be signing up for these companies. I want to tell you the good things about these companies, and this is for me doing a little research. The big thing that's really good is that you log into the website when you're ready to work. So it's flexible. So say if you want to make an extra $50 a month or even $100 a month, whatever works for you. You can log into the website to see if work is available at the time that you're ready to do it, which is really fabulous. The other thing that I like is they have 13 other languages. So I'm not sure if you get paid more if you know more than one language, but at least that's something to know about. The pros about this is it does pay weekly. They offer you training, and I've heard that both companies are really good, and they both pay promptly. You don't have to beg for your pay, which is good. Flexible hours and easy work. The only downside from doing my research is it doesn't pay really well. If you stick with it, you get faster at doing it and listening and pointing out things. But like everything, when you first start doing it, it's a learning curve. But this is what I say. I know a lot of these work at home ideas don't pay great. But if you're homebound anyway and you're not making a lot of money or because of maybe you're on disability. And I've had a few of you email me and say, hey, I'm a disability. I'm only allowed to make so much. So say if that's the case and you're only allowed to make an extra 300 a month. Well, that extra 300 a month is a real blessing to you. So if you could do something like this and make an extra 50 a month, do surveys and maybe make an extra 40 a month doing that, every little bit helps. That's groceries, gas, whatever you want to use the money for. So I'm going to put these links below and they've got a fact page that you can look up facts so that you can look at the information to see what questions. They also have a contact us button. So they both look like professionals. I made sure that they weren't scams and they're both rated high. The only downside was you don't make tons of money. That's the only thing. The other, the skills that you really need for this is good listening skills, pay attention to detail, and to be objective. So like I said, I'll link these below. Let me know if you guys have done work for these companies. I always ask this because I'm always looking for fresh ideas because every Monday I come up with something new and I'm trying not to copy what everyone else is doing. Let me know if you know any other work at home ideas because I've got a lot of folks that are homebound that would like to make money from their computer but they want to do something that's legit. Let me know in the comments below. This is Money Mom signing off and as always I love you. Bye bye.